Now to the Democrats and their reaction. Two members of the U.S. House from Southern California were on the committee that investigated the riots. They were also in the Capitol during the attack. And KCAL News reporter Lori Perez is live in Westwood now with comments from Adam Schiff and Pete Aguilar and Democratic voters. Lori? Well, this is a moment some Democrats have been waiting for. That being said, Southland politicians are not gloating, at least not publicly. These charges were a long time in coming, and it's about time. Burbank Democrat Adam Schiff. He served on the House committee that investigated the Capitol riot and is a vocal critic of the president. We need accountability. Donald Trump must be held to the same rule of law as everyone else. This is the most serious crime against our democracy in history, uh, and justice must be served. A message echoed by other Democrats from California, including Congressman Pete Aguilar from Redlands, who also served on the January 6th committee. The January 6th Capitol attack was an assault on our democracy, and everyone involved must be held accountable, including Donald Trump. In our country, nobody is above the law. And South Bay Congressman Ted Lieu, who served as impeachment manager in Trump's second impeachment, said on social media, Trump indicted again by a grand jury of regular Americans, this time for attempting to overturn the will of the voters and for obstructing an official proceeding. Trump is presumed to be innocent and the judicial process should be allowed to proceed without political interference. A less political response? I can't do any swear words. He should go to jail. From people on the street. Yes, I'm glad that he was indicted. I'm really glad, and I hope they do something about our justice system where he can be indicted, he can go through the whole course of going through a jury, and being convicted, not getting to be president, and he go to jail. It's about time. I think a lot of us have been waiting for this for, uh, for a long time, and we're uh, happy to see this happen. Though some are worried about what, if anything, happens next. I feel like people that are high up have a lot of money. They get lawyers, and then they kind of get out of things. I honestly don't think anything's really going to happen. I think, you know, some things you don't think will happen in your lifetime, I guess. Now, some people we spoke with said they are bracing for the lengths they think Trump and some Republicans will go to in defending him against these charges. In Westwood, I'm Lori Perez, KCAL News, back to you. All right, Lori, thank you. And stay with KCAL News for the very